guys, welcome to a new video. In today's video, we're gonna be unboxing my uh, order from Delta Art in Edmonton, Alberta. And yeah, let's get into it. So I ordered some supplies for my uh, art journaling and mixed media work. And these are things I've never used before. And it, I actually ordered it back in March and it's May now. Um, and it took a while to get here because there was a mix up with my order. And uh, I put down the wrong phone number on the website and it was just a whole hassle. They were really nice and helped me work it out. So that's awesome. All right, so package list enclosed, okay. stuff in here, in here, all right, so I guess the first thing we can open is this, so um, for something that I'm painting, I wanted it to have a glowy kind of luminous green effect, and so I got this neon green uh, paint from Holbein. And so I can't wait to use that. Oh, wow. Okay, so these are my first oil pastels that are artist grade. And I'm really, really excited to use these. Um, I think they're probably really messy. I'm, I'm not sure, but wow. I can't believe I finally have them because I've seen people use them in YouTube videos and they just look like so much fun. Okay. So as you can see, I got quite a few colors. And um, I guess I'll tell you the colors that I got. Um, actually, let's swatch these out on here. Let's swatch them on this uh, watercolor paper. Maybe we'll do it on this side. So something that I didn't really get when I was, oh, sorry for the hun bun. There you go. So something that I didn't think to get was uh, dark colors, like a Payne's gray type color or a black. And I didn't get a white, I just didn't think of it. So next time I'm definitely gonna have to pick up those colors. But let's start. So this is spring green. Oh wow, that's really cool. So I wanted to get some artist grade pastels because the colors are a lot brighter than uh, student grade ones. Oh, this goes on so smooth. Wow. Yeah, so the colors are more pigmented and brighter. Oh, and this one was ruby red and um, I hear that uh, the artist grade ones apply a lot smoother and easier this is jeans blue violet very nice um, uh, carmine Wow, these are so cool. They're kind of like lipstick, like applying lipstick. Aubergine, which I think is eggplant. And olive yellow. I'm really into these limey, olivey chartreuse colors. I really love them, so I got some colors in that range. And I got two of the same ones by accident. So I think I got two scarlet. Did I get two? No, I got two ruby red. So I already did that one. And then yeah, this one's scarlet. This one I'm really looking forward to. It's purplish red. It's just so pigmented. Wow. And uh, golden yellow.
then lime green. Raspberry red, which is definitely more of a pink. Um, light olive, that's pretty. Ooh, I love this one. Uh, turquoise blue. Oh wow, that's so pretty. Um, ochre. I love that one too. I love them all. I'm so excited. Um, and the last one is Malachite Green. So those are really awesome. I can't wait to do something with them. I'm not sure what I'm doing with them, but I'm excited to figure that out. <laughs> all right, and so these are all obviously by Karen Dash, and they're the Neo Pastels. And these are the Neo Color 2s by Karen Dash. And so these are water soluble. And yeah. All right. So for these ones, I'm just going to get out my water. So uh, yeah, I got out my water for these and uh, this is a brush I haven't used yet. I'm gonna be using it for oil painting, so I'm just gonna try it out here. And Hun Bun has made a return and yet another exit, <laughs> a swift exit. <laughs> so uh, yeah, all right. So the first one is light blue. That's very cool. And the next one is Golden Ochre. So I got a lot of similar colors like the ones in the Neo Pastels because I just am drawn to those colors. Interesting. This one is ruby red. And yeah, so I've never used a material like this before. I really love this red, it's so pretty. But yeah, I've never used any art supplies like this before, so this is gonna be so much fun to play with. Oh, and this one is saffron. This one is turquoise green. Oh, that is such a beautiful color. Wow. Oh, that's so pretty. I love this color. This one's my favorite so far. <laughs> and second up is that one. All right, and the purple. Oh, that's really pretty too. Makes me think of more of a magenta than a straight up purple. And we have lemon yellow. That's a really nice yellow. Very pretty. And mauve. And then malachite green. I love how rich this is. It's so beautiful. Oh wow, that is, wow. 
<laughs> That's such a pretty color. Oh my goodness. Okay, and then next we have um, Crimson Alizarin. I think I'm used to that being Alizarin Crimson. <laughs> Oh, that's a nice color. It's like a like a blood red or a Venetian red. Something like that. Probably closer to a Venetian red. And the last one is Scarlet. And that is all of those swatched. So I'm just curious, which color is your favorite out of all of these? Or if you have a set of these yourself, um, which colors are your favorite? And I'd also love to know um, what sort of things you do with these. Like uh, I've seen people paint florals and all sorts of things, but what do you do with them? And uh, what do you think I should do with them? And yeah, basically looking for your ideas. <laughs> so yeah, um, I guess while we're here, we can swatch out this one. I don't know how well it will show on camera because I believe it is a neon. So let's just take a little bit of this out. Oh, that is so bright, <laughs> holy. Oh wow. I hope it's showing on camera. That is super, super bright. Wow, I wanna get the luminous yellow too, if there is one. Cause yeah, I wanna get all the neons. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this little uh, haul and swatch video. Hope you enjoyed it. And I really wanna hear what you guys think of these in the comments. So don't be afraid to drop a little comment. Oh yeah, and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Peace guys.